2018 is a time we'll all remember. The year when the coalition against insurance fraud turned 25 years strong. It's more than an anniversary though. It's the story of a handshake that helped change fraud fighting forever. At the beginning, it took a supreme act of courage to create the coalition, but it's an alliance that almost never was. The year was 1993. Consumer groups and insurance companies had little faith in each other. They had been locking horns for years. High auto premiums, redlining, and other differences kept both camps wary and distrustful. They couldn't agree on much, but could they take a gamble and join forces to combat one thing they did have in common? Insurance fraud was spreading fast, often with little resistance. Swindlers came from the old Soviet Union to stage crashes and run large medical rings. The temptation for otherwise honest consumers to pad a claim or even fake a loss was building. The cost of fraud was adding up in the billions. Several insurance companies took a big chance. Working through the American Insurance Association, they reached out to the leading consumer advocates. On the other side, the Consumer Federation of America decided to take the risk as well. They sought an alliance that would unite all factions against insurance fraud. That handshake of trust was a courageous move. Some people on both sides felt that joining together was like getting in bed with the enemy. This was a make or break moment. Reputations were on the line. State insurance commissioners, district attorneys, several insurers and other consumer groups boldly signed on to become founding members, 16 organizations in all. The Coalition Against Insurance Fraud was announced at a standing room only news conference in Washington, DC. This new diverse alliance was hailed as the only group of its kind in America, one that would combat all forms of insurance fraud. Its mission, help enact strong fraud laws, educate consumers and conduct in-depth, credible research. And overall, help build a forceful fraud fighting community across the US. The growing pains were nearly fatal. Back then, states had few fraud laws to use against insurance criminals. So one of the coalition's first goals was to draft a model insurance fraud law. Yet, coalition members were deeply divided. Some insurance companies didn't want a law that could be used against them. The fragile new alliance likely would fold unless consensus was achieved. After nearly a year of sometimes heated debate, the coalition board approved the most comprehensive model fraud law in U.S. history. Shortly thereafter, a Model Fraud Bureau Act was crafted as well. The years passed, trust kept building, and the coalition's legislative efforts gained steam. By 2003, all but four states had enacted fraud laws, and 40 fraud bureaus were created, with many using the coalition's model as the starting point. The coalition continues to be a sought-after voice in state capitals, continuing to fight for strong fraud laws, whether to stop shady contractors, put the brakes on staged crash rings, or even keep children from being murdered for life insurance. Improving consumer awareness, attitude, and behavior was another pillar of our mission. Early on, a comprehensive public outreach program was launched. Our unified voice of consumers, insurers, and government was the rock that made reporters and consumers trust the coalition. Well over 10,000 news stories carried the coalition's messages, whether they dealt with fraud involving auto, homeowners, workers' comp, health insurance, or insider scams. One year, we discovered fake health plans were defrauding hundreds of thousands of consumers around the nation. We alerted newspaper and TV reporters who in turn warned consumers across the US. More than 700 news stories about bogus health plans were published. That coverage helped lead to prosecutions, saved consumers from being scammed, and helped trigger a wave of reforms by state legislatures. Since that time, the coalition has become an even more credible and trusted source for consumer information. And for all things insurance fraud, coalition research has also greatly increased understanding about public attitudes, 
about scams and effective ways to combat fraud. Today, the Coalition is a thriving alliance, with uniting the fraud fight as our core mission. From that first handful of gutsy pioneers, more than 175 organizations now call themselves Coalition members. We'll play an ever-growing role in keeping America safe from insurance fraud. And to think, it all started with that one gamble of a handshake. <laughs>